first open party gen and you click generate move your mouse pointer in the blank area to speed up the process as instructed now the keys are generated you type in the, the key passphrase to protect your private key and save the private key to your local computer just give a name save now you open putty you type in the remote host you want to log in and save it for later use and the open connect now you log into remote host now go to the directory dot ssh if it doesn't exist just create a one use an ed text editor to open a file called an authorized key now back to your party gen window copy the public key and the paste it here and save it next change the permission of this file to read only by yourself and exit open uh, putty again and you load the session you just saved and move to your mouse to SSH and auth and select the private key now go to the place that you saved the private key and double click and enter the passphrase you chose for it you click OK and then you click the open the putty you log in now this time you're logged in without being a prompt for password or passphrase.